sitting here thinking, what can save today? Answer, <laughs> chocolate. I can have chocolate <laughs> at any time, all day long, constantly, and it seems like we found the perfect restaurant for me. All right. it, yeah, it yeah. does sound that way, doesn't it? Yeah, that's pretty interesting. We have a Chaco Bar Cortez in the Bronx yes. where they're not only cooking up great desserts, but also savory dishes with chocolate at the forefront. Choco Bar Cortez uh, is based off of my family's 95-year-old chocolate manufacturing company, Chocolate Cortez, uh, which is based in Puerto Rico and the Dominican Republic. The idea was kind of to create a space that was sort of celebrating that tradition of our chocolate because it's something that you know a lot of people grew up with our chocolate. They have sort of fond memories, a lot of nostalgia. Something that's really unique about our company is that we are almost completely vertically integrated, meaning that we work directly with the farmers and make the chocolate ourselves and then you know serve it to you here at the restaurants. So we'll start with the grilled cheese. It's a brioche bread with cheddar cheese and chocolate butter. So really simple, really delicious. The tacos are mofongo shells. And mofongo is a typical Puerto Rican dish that is mashed plantain and then fried. We take it a step further and make it into a taco shell, which then you can, it comes with sort of roast pork, pineapple pico de gallo, and then it comes with our chocolate hot sauce to add that chocolate element. Most popular drink is choco martini. It's really simple. It's just our you know, frozen chocolate mix. It's got vodka and Irish cream, and that's it. We shave some white chocolate on top. And the other cocktail is called our Don Ignacio, which is named after my father and my grandfather. So it's kind of like an old fashioned, but with rum. And it comes in a glass that has a 70% dark chocolate rim. It kind of melts in your mouth as you drink the cocktail. You know, when people come to the space, they, they're just so surprised at how beautiful it is or, you know, that it transports them to the Caribbean. That's what it's all about, is to really keep that tradition alive, keep our culture alive, give people who don't know about our culture the opportunity to learn about it and, and learn about, you know, everything that we have to offer. Oh my God. I love yeah, that. Everybody here is salivating. <laughs> and you oh. can head to abc 7 and ycom slash mornings at 10 for more Neighborhood Eats. And Are we going? Sounds like a place we yeah. going? to visit. Okay. I'm in physical pain not being able to eat that right now. That is top of my list. Oh, that sounds so good. Got to get to the forecast, though. This